the other piece of it is that corporations are involved in all of this too. Talk a little bit about the role that corporations play in our in our complex, our assassination complex. Right. Well, I mean, first of all, many of the slides uh, that were uh, produced that we have in the book uh, for the U.S. military were actually done by a national security division of the IBM Corporation. Uh, where they have a whole national security division. And what, what we did is we also, we, we analyzed, and they use some of the same language and actually the same templates for slides that are about killing people, hunting and killing people, uh, for other corporate clients. And they use, the, the it's, it's, it, it really, it, it seems like they are, are producing widgets. You know, mm -hmm. I mean, that's how they talk about it. And, 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 and the banality of evil just is kind of oozing from these things because it's like, who are the people? Who are the authors who wrote these documents that refer to find, fix, finish? You know, all, all of these terms that they use, and we have a whole glossary of them in there. Um, but I mean, corporations are making a killing off of this yeah. killing. Uh, you have Boeing, Lockheed Martin, and then you have these huge farms filled with private contractors who are on loan or being rented to the U.S. government to be drone pilots or to be intelligence analysts, and and those individuals are essentially part of a matrix. Uh, that is a for-profit industry of killing. Um, and, and it's wrapped in the sort of flag of patriotism and national security. But at the end of the day, there's very little difference between uh, what is happening now with the warfare industry and drones as what happened with Lyndon Johnson when he was throwing uh, contracts to Bell mm -hmm. Helicopter because they were a Texas company and the Vietnam War seemed like a great market for them. Mm -hmm.